Oh no, you're good. Oh, okay, cool. You know, I, I just wanted to make sure, you know, make sure, you know, wouldn't make you feel like you was at home. <laughs> well, yeah, we live now. Five star experience. Oh, yeah, we the, the five star experience. Yeah, we, you get a five star experience right here. <laughs> What's good, y'all, man? We we Hello. live in this thing. What's, What's good, y'all? Oh. What's going down, everybody? What's good, man? RTC Podcast, episode 31. We in Woo. this thing. You feel me? In this thing, man. Ooh, we in the 30s. Yeah, I know, right? We got Mally. He, she on the road again. You know what I'm Ooh, saying? Watch out. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> she on the road again, man. Western if Road. If y'all caught us in the middle of our laughter, we was basically talking about how every guy, when a chick comes over to the crib, they find ways to clean up. Like... They they start getting the decorative tiles out. They start getting the Febreze out. Dishes start getting magically washed. Trash get magically taken out. And then you know what I'm saying? The ambience is set, you know. And it's 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 a funny situation because I think every guy nice. has had that one had that one experience. Unless you just really grimy and you don't care, <laughs> like super grimy, uh -huh. and you don't give a you damn. Get how, how you your get this goes. question? You sure you stay by yourself? <laughs> oh yeah, that question. Yeah, yeah, man. Damn, looks, that's cold. Yeah. No, no, they they asked that. You that's sit cold. alone. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. You sure? They're trying to see how comfortable they can be. It's not somebody else's place. Mm -hmm. No, I mean, if it is, exactly, why, why Warren, exactly. They want to see if they can if they can let they they let if they can let their guard down a lot, a hundred percent. Sitting on that couch. Hey, I got some wine for you. Guard. Oh really? Guard. Yeah. For sure, guard. And then you uh you bring out the the only time you use the wine glasses you bring it out and you hold it like this. Here you go. Oh, thank you. Yo, every everybody <laughs> got those special occasion wine glasses. I heard you. Mm hmm The special occasion the wine special glasses. You don't, wine you don't glasses. use it for nothing else. Top of the top of the cupboard. Yeah, they don't touch them. Oh. Yeah, the top. They got the dust. Top. They got dust on the. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you gotta, yeah, you gotta rinse it out first. You gotta rinse it out first. So, uh -huh. got to, gotta rinse it out. Everybody got them. <laughs> we didn't know. <laughs> you start, you start sitting with your legs crossing and everything. You don't sit like that, nigga. <laughs> why you? Nigga ain't like that. Why you acting brand new, nigga? <laughs> Nervous. That nigga ain't like that. Uh -huh. You don't want to rush into it. The niggas start using the real plates, not even the Hello. paper plates. We nah, got the you, homie. We got the homie for joining like three in. And three different times. Mm -hmm. <laughs> paper plates. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We got, <clears throat> we'll be on deck with the paper plates. So paper plate, all right. The paper plate just for me. Yeah, it's, it's a thing. Cool, so if I drop out, I won't feel bad. <laughs> The paper play just me. <laughs> this nigga look like he ain't had a hard workout. We got the we got the homie Demond in here today, man. What up, What's up? What what up? What up? Melissa uh, planned her Melissa planned her her escape. Thomas, oh yeah. So if I drop out, I mean it's cool. It's <laughs> a pink a pink slip gonna be sent to you. Listen, y'all 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 basically fired me already. Yo, when do we get when do we have five? When do you not call your job and tell them you're going to be late? <laughs> that was a no call, no show. What? So y'all already a... had a plan. Y'all already had a plan of escape. We waited, nah, though. Nah, I say my plan, shout it. Look, look. I don't even get paid. I'm just here. <laughs> he, he on his second day of insubordination, man. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, I boss. Said, I said good day. <laughs> I said good day. Come on, boss. But what's going on, Demond? Demond in here looking real. DeMond got the Listen. old person view. You know how old people. Wanna, oh my god, he got the under the chin. Yeah, the hey. under the chin. I can't see him. How you work this grandson? He took no, his glasses like, off. Oh, oh, oh. so how you work this thing? How you, how you work this grandson? Can he do one of them? Y'all can see me now. You we see? You. See? <laughs> when the nigga see, hit the... <laughs> can y'all see me now? Can y'all hear me? <laughs> Am I good? Can you mic check? Mic check. <laughs> oh my god! This nigga did the mic check, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, you see my headphones? Ah, oh, damn. Hey, 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 get this nigga out of here! What are you doing? 
Making me look bad, Demond. Oh, my bad, y'all. You go ahead and head out. You can't. Hey, you called it personally. That is. Personally, what the fuck is that, dude, bro? Hey, baby, on my headphones. We look. We looking like a circus. Demond just getting on here, not knowing what's going on. Malisha driving. We don't know if she's gonna be here the whole pod. I probably won't. But listen. Oh my God. garbage! The, the, the thing fire. is, I'm I called in. I through. called in just to see how y'all was doing, what y'all was doing, you know, how how things were going. Well, you know, what? before we before you leave us, we want to get your take <laughs> on on WAP. What do you feel about WAP? How uh, people are, you know, responded to it? How do you feel about it? As well? <sighs> That's you know, all right, y'all. Listen, <laughs> <That's a song. laughs> right? So it's not. It, it's the next. He could be. It's not just a taco or a taco and a fried rice. Neither. I want a uh, taco. Hey, hold on, baby. I'm, uh, uh, oh my god! <laughs> this nigga get his dinner, bro. What the tacos or rice? Sorry, folks. Hey, D. <clears throat> Don't start no conversation. Hello, hey, we gonna have to start off. <laughs> we doing the uh, the podcast, baby. <laughs> oh, we ain't starting shit over, huh? Oh we doing a, uh, really like an old we, Nah, what you mean? I'm a husband. Just a, babe, give me the rice with the taco. But low I'm low on the rice. I'm trying to load my cards. All right. What's up, y'all? Uh, I quit. You know, y'all can have a pie. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. Niggas, niggas going to be in the comments. No, Todd, you can't leave, bro. Nah, y'all, y'all got it. Nah, <laughs> hey, hey, well, you, you can say you low on the cards. So... Yeah, I, yeah, I, 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 I thought he was gonna, gonna be ready. Off. I thought he was I gonna be ready, bro. I do. I'm gonna take off, bro. I'm gonna put in my uh my days off request. Letter for resignation. Yeah, yeah, you get yeah, you, bro. Letter of resignation. You you watched the whole. Hey, but it's listen, shit. she never answered my people. question. People, people, I, I tried mama. to, but he started talking about dinner. Rice and beans and gravy and taco shells. Hey, at least the, the fans know that it's pure, man. Ain't no. Why your face all back up? Why are you chewing the uh, camera, man? Oh, my bad, dog. I'm trying to figure out where it's at. Oh, oh my God. I told you I quit. <laughs> yeah, I got Boy. it. Man. Take us to the championship, Ross. <laughs> hey, bro. <laughs> I got it. <laughs> my my no, bad, no, y'all. I, I do want to hear what Malisha got to say about Yeah, yeah. Let's, I mean, say about it. Let's get your take on uh, All right. WAP. Real quick, guys. Mm -hmm, I real. personally, <clears throat> I don't really like the song, but I'm not opposed to the song. Okay. And the reason why is because men have been talking about T and A and lick my balls. What's T and A? I said D and A. What's D and A? What is that? D and A like deoxyribonucleic acid DNA or what are you talking about? Dallas to Atlanta. Anyways, <laughs> niggas have been talking about sex with women and derogatory things forever. Mm -hmm. But when a female come out and shock they draws, they don't know how to feel about it. <clears throat> so it's like, oh, that's 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 disrespectful. It's trashy. It's okay, nigga, but you're not talking about Jay Z and Nas and they started early with the shit, like in the eighties. So we don't want I don't want to hear any of that. Like, do I think it's women empowerment? No. Am okay. I opposed to it? I am not. It's <clears throat> what they do. It's what they do to get money. All right, cool, whatever. I'm not knocking it. But I mean, I personally don't really like the song. Okay. I so, so if it come on, you ain't turning up. You gonna stand still. The, the beginning part, like the beat, I'd be like, yeah. right. there's some uh, holes in this house. There's some holes in this house. There's some holes in this house. I can feel a little bit, you know. Yeah. Mm. See, like, no. like, she go crazy. Like yeah, she go crazy. She be going crazy. <laughs> Especially when yeah, Meg came on. I honestly only heard it one time that. full through. I heard it one time full through. And if I really like a song, I'm going to keep playing it over and over. <laughs> honestly, I'm just not really. I'm not really. Like, I don't really feel it like that. So. You don't look like you putting your signal light on when you're getting over either. Wow. I know you hear it. I know you hear it. I don't. <laughs> wow. I just see your head moving. But, um, Too bad because I'm, I'm driving safe. <laughs> Okay, well, we hear you. <laughs> we'll tell Allstate. <laughs> I don't have Allstate. So. Oh, cool. Oh, my bad. My bad. Oh, all right. What's going on in the background? 
mind. All you hear is pots and pans. You can tell it's the mind because he itching. He like nervous about uh, it. Oh, y'all hear the TV? We hear the pots, hear pots and pans. We hear everything, bro. We hear the ceiling fan. We hear <laughs> we hear the light. Yo, you hear all that, but you don't hear my signal. No, we don't hear your signal at all. You just getting over. You're lying. I, I am. You crazy taxi over there. Hey, that was a classic game. But to not classic. get off topic, so <laughs> how you feel about it, uh, Gray? What's your what's your thoughts on the song? Uh, my thoughts on why when I first heard it, mm-hmm. when I first heard it, I was like, ah, it's alright. Mm-hmm. But I think that was why. I think it was because I didn't watch the video with it. Oof. I think I think watching the video kind of made a. a a significant difference. Yes. Um, yes, it did. But <laughs> so of course it did. Yeah, I mean, like of as, as a guy, like it was nice to see ass and titties and stuff. But do I like the song? Not to say I don't like it, but I'm not gonna turn a hoe on and jam it or whatever. You know, like you know. I, but it was it was nice. It was it was nice for you know, you know, from the viewpoint. Yeah. You know. <laughs> right. And and just to hear them talk about that kind of stuff, you know, it's kind of. You know, whatever. I don't know. It's sexy, I guess. Sexy, <laughs> Like it is what it is. It ain't like too much on it. Yeah. At least not for me. Yeah, it's like it's all, it's okay. Like it's not really a to me. It's not really a big deal. It's okay. like oh okay. Okay, so since we all pretty much feel the same about it, it's like ah. Eh, but how do y'all feel about people? The controversy that kind of arised uh, in the mixed reviews that people are kind of like bashing it, and then some people are like go for it. How do y'all feel about that? I feel like that's that's, 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 the same. that's what everything yeah. is, you know, mm-hmm. and especially with when it comes to women doing that kind of stuff, like, yeah, it's going to be controversy because I'm assuming everybody just expects women to, you know, be uplifting and empowered and classy. And it's like, nah, sometimes you got those chicks that want to be down and dirty and they can, you know, they can get that shit off too. Like, you know. Mm-hmm. So right. y'all, it kills me when people be like, "I want an Erica Badu, I want a, a um, a Jill Scott." I'm like, both of them got cheated on and cheated. So, I mean, I'm I'm confused as to what you want. Like, you want them to be covered? Because if that's it, then that's that's a small price to pay for. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. What, what them get cheated on got to do with anything? Morals and ethics. <laughs> I'm just saying because that's what they're talking about doing. You know. Oh, they, they they make songs about sex and effing and all of that other stuff. Like it's the same thing. The only thing is that they, because I'm I'm trying to I'm trying to work on the PG my PG podcast. I respect I am. it. I am. I'm really trying to. Ooh, I'm trying to work on my um on my cussing. Um, <laughs> what about you, Demond? Yeah, you what you think? It? You look like you ready. No, you prepared. <laughs> I've been uh I've been talking about uh, no 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 I'm gonna say it like this um is that a dance? I think it just it is what it is you know I saw the video and the song um actually I don't mind the video but the song itself I mean the lyrics is is just like goddamn okay it's straight I mean I mean I don't have a daughter. Mm-hmm. So I will put it in this perspective. I, if I catch my daughter listening to it, I probably have a heart attack. Mm. So mm. even though mm. you know mm. it's a it's a it's a slight form of woman empowerment, women empowerment, which it is. It, but it's just like, I mean, the lyrics, man. You just listen to it. You just like, God damn. <laughs> Bro, why did, yeah. hey, why did I mean, I never heard. I gotta lay down on my floor now. But why no, I, I, I mean, I've before. I, that's the thing. All right, though. so she you gone. Know, we, we, mm-hmm. we, we could be fellas now. Come on, let's go ahead. You talk your shit. Let's now. be real. Let's be real, Demon. <laughs> <laughs> you saw them titties out. You like, God damn. damn. <laughs> my, my wife downstairs. Sapa. Uh, so you know what I'm saying. My wife not here. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to mess up a happy home. <laughs> <laughs> she ain't offering no tacos for nobody else. Just him. <laughs> I, I mean, listen, man. It's a, it's a it's a dope song. It's a dope video, man. It just. I could probably only hear it one time and probably won't ever play it again. Right. But for for the people who into that kind of stuff who wanna wanna just be out there living that single life, hoing around, man, that's that. I mean, the song is dope. It's just it's good for you. I mean, that's that's all I gotta say. <laughs> it's, it, it's, for it's, you. It's, it's it's the anthem. You do your thing. You know what I'm saying? You, you get dressed, ready up. You just hit up your side, nigga. 
You letting them know you about to drop them jaws in that nigga? You play that song? Why you riding in the car? Yeah, that's, a lot of inf- that's a lot of information there, man. You, I mean, I'm right? just saying. That's, that's how I feel about This live the life. Right. You got the that's whole how, checklist. No no no. no, 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 no. Wait a minute. This is for the females <laughs> to do that. You know? got the whole checklist on them. Yeah, but I'm father. Thank you, G. I am. I think you're trying to stay married. Drop the jaws. <laughs> Let them know you're ready. <laughs> I'm just saying. That's just how I feel. Um, I and mean, don't come, I don't know. Don't come I, with that weak sex. You got to bring it in. That's what they. That's what they telling me. Is, you know, I don't know. You know, see, okay. <laughs> don't come in here with the weak sex. <laughs> the, I mean, that's what the song is saying, man. That's, mean, fair. Yeah. that's fair. It's fair. It's fair. I mean, I, I, I get you. You know, you got to come with it. But um, I, I got, I kind of got what you said when you was like, if you heard your daughter listening to it, you know, yeah. And so that kind of makes me be like, mm, yeah, you got to be mindful of what you are promoting. You uh, got to. Because the children, the children. They, they, be, they be listening in, 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 in you know. And even know. though even though our generation, we heard some songs as well back in the day. But it was. You had to do a lot to hear them songs. You, you had like, to do a lot. You had to reach <laughs> out your best to hear the song. Now Not it's really. a click of a button. Mm-mm. That yin really. yang, yin yang twin song, the whisper song. Yeah, like yeah, come on now. Y'all <laughs> that was that was on the radio. Yeah, it's y'all just knew, they. Y'all know we came up on some stuff. <laughs> on what radio? Hey, how you, you doing? Know what? Mama, let me whisper in your ear. You know what? Yeah. You know what? That's that's that, that's, you know that's, what? that's that's PG compared to what? No. Oh, okay, okay. Nah, what, about, what about what about that it's David not. Banner song? Uh, uh. Who? David Banner. Fuck how that song go. What? You talking about? No, no, come on. <laughs> well, he was damn with that. He was talking about uh, he was let's, talking about something about pussy. Let's um, get the let's get the googling, man. <laughs> what is it? What is it? I I have it in my head, bro. I know what you're talking about. Yeah. Oh my god, it, I, it's not coming to me. But I mean, it's even then, bro. You had to like they wasn't just playing that on regular music video hours. Mm-hmm. It wasn't a and single. Was a single. Oh, it wasn't a single. oh, you talking but about? They, a but play? they was like PG. Who? You talking about play? Come, yeah, 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 trying yeah, yeah. to get this. Yeah. But yeah. when we watched oh, that shit, like, oh, yeah. yeah. he said, "Why you smirk like that?" Yeah. But, but but it was PG when I, we watched I, it. I do. Like Damn, the uh, lyrics, you couldn't just watch that on regular TV. Nobody on, generation man. is safe. You had to stay up for BT Uncut. Y'all reaching, man. Y'all know we came up on some stuff, dog. No, I'm not saying we didn't come up on it, but I feel like it's easier now for them to access stuff to just come across something on Instagram or just be on YouTube and an ad pop up. <laughs> it's like it's so much easier now for them mm-hmm. to kind of be exposed to it. The technology yeah. wasn't where it is. If the technology mm-hmm. was oh, it, where it was back then, oh, bruh. Yeah, it'd have been the same thing, you know. We it probably would have been shit. worse. Nigga yeah, stayed up. Right. Nigga stayed up to watch Tip Drill. You know what I'm saying? You had to put in work to get that action. You, you had to figure it out. But it was there. Either, though. either way, we, we no, it was the there. Exit. Yeah, but now we it's not even exit. hard. Either way, like think about how much sicker our generation would have been <laughs> with this technology. Come on, yeah, I'm already sick. So <laughs> yeah, so imagine yeah. it would have been awful. You'd that's be dead. A, <laughs> but that's a great point. So that's a great Scorpion, point. Scorpion oh, King my. over there. <laughs> We had Instagram, and you had it like being able to be exposed to people from all over the world, and you could DM them too, <laughs> privately. Oh, no, privately. That was called MySpace. I was just thinking, imagine if we can customize our own Instagram page. We was like older. MySpace did it. That was my no. We was, we was older with MySpace. Y'all older guess, than me. I guess I was in some shit when I was a kid then, because I was on Black People. I was on Black Planet. Black people, me. <laughs> not the black planet. No. I was on all that shit, so I was sick. No, the black planet. You definitely, definitely was sick. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm like, what y'all talking about? Like, we had that. Man, my very first one, my very mean. first one was Tag, if y'all remember that one. Oh, yeah. I, I remember Tag, tag but I ain't have yeah. one. Yeah. Well, yeah, I had that one. Y'all was sick, man. He <laughs> said, y'all were sick. See what he did there. <laughs> Y'all were sick. Y'all were this sick. light-skinned motherfucker, no goddamn well. Niggas, he bro. was he was definitely hey. part of the sicko mode. <laughs> you don't want it in me. I he speak didn't... of I speak of no old sickness. I only no claim I only seek and claim healing from okay. now to the future. Okay. okay. All right. Um, 
I just I just couldn't imagine us with this technology, bro. Like it would have been really, really bad. Like just mm-hmm. horrible. Cause we were some little quick sneaky motherfuckers. So we was always trying to figure out a way around some shit. Mm-hmm. So thanks. Thanks, I could thanks. just imagine. I mean yeah. we were sneaking bringing Playboy magazines to school, man, and <laughs> looking at them during between classes. Well, I I wanna say we I was yeah. doing that. Why is the page so sticky? (laughs) Page 13 and 14 together. Stuck together. I gotta ask him. (laughs) But nah, man. Uh, The song is is cool. Or whatnot. It's, it's, I think, personally, uh, Megan saved the track for me, in my opinion. Her delivery Mm -hmm. on there Mm -hmm. was nice. Nah, she she killed it. she, she, She killed that, like, she killed that feature for sure. She I think. she one of the best female delivery since MC Light to me, in my opinion, bro. Okay. She, she can she can she can spit on the mic, man. The no, she can let it loose. Stop. I, I mean, mm, yeah. MC Light though, you gonna you gonna go that far? No, no, I'm just saying, like the way how MC it. Light used to deliver on the mic. I mean, you got Eve. I'm, yeah, Eve was good. You got too a lot on the of mic. people. Eve didn't rap about my big. Eve was like spit like nigga. She was that first album. She he dropped, was, was uh, rapping about whooping your ass. Like, yeah, she, yeah, she, yeah. She, was she was spitting. Um, yeah, yeah. But nah, yeah, I think uh, Megan's delivery definitely saved the track for me personally. But it's it's not for me to be like, oh yeah, this is something I need to bump in the whip. It's for the women to turn up, have a good time. So I don't see a problem with it. I, I think people are just quick to find something to complain about. I don't know if y'all know. They started a petition to get Kylie Jenner removed from the video, bro. Why? Yeah, hey, I thought it. Uh, I don't why? know why, bro. <laughs> they oh, yeah. I think that's why, because they don't know why. I think they were saying, why was she in the video? Now? Yeah, so they made, made a petition. I, I did see that. To get her shit removed. Bro, it's I, like, bro, why? I hate people. Who, <laughs> who is the doctor that, that, that changed her? Like yeah, you seen that, that Ross? I told he, you. I said, boy, Travis must have been bringing her to them cookouts. Bro, who, bro, the, whoever the doctor is, he should like that. Should be his brand, is Kylie. Cause I mean, yeah, yo, this nigga the You know, because I, I know what she used lips. to look like. She didn't. I, I know what she used to look like. And mm-hmm. her lips and don't I'm, look I'm, like retarded either. Mm-hmm. No, they be trying to inject everything. Them. It looked like it's a her pure body. That's mm-hmm. what it looked like. And it's like, yo, whoever that doctor is, he should get 10% on every model picture she done took, every anything with yeah. an image of her body. He should get the commission on it because he did a damn good job, whoever that he, person was. He did a fantastic <laughs> job, bro. And he hit the I, salute. And let, and let, let's, let's give it up for that, brother. Yeah, yeah no, no, seriously. Or, seriously or uh, yeah, yeah, it could be, it could be both. Was, and maybe a tag was. team effort, you never know. Right. You, huh. They start. They start removing stuff and sculpting stuff. Yeah. Nah, yeah. yeah, she went to build a body. And, uh, she, oh, no. Nah. Yeah. She got something <laughs> she, she could walk out there proud of. Yeah. Um, so, I mean, but, hey, it, it is what it is. It's, it's a track just for people, you know, for the women to turn up. I don't see the, the big yeah. issue about hoopla. it. Yeah, the hoopla about it. Uh, it if you know, if you listen to their music before, that's what they talk about. <laughs> What it, is, is, what it is, is if you're looking for trouble, you're going to find it. So it's like, Facts. it's a lot of things you can complain about. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Mm-hmm. Let's talk about the cops who still haven't been arrested that, you know, killed Breonna Taylor. You know what I'm Facts. saying? Like, mm-hmm. if, if, you, if you put your scope out there, you're going to find a bunch of trouble. So you know what people did? They went fishing. They just went fishing for some shit. They seen a, a video that's, you know, explicit. But there's a lot of videos that are explicit. You got people <laughs> that are satanic, worshiping the devil, doing all kind of crazy shit in videos. But yet, you don't see people talking about that and what it's doing to people in that life. You know, mm-hmm. people just, they just found something they wanted to be up in arms about. And then that's where all this come from. If you don't want to watch the video, if you don't like it, cut the shit off, keep scrolling, keep moving on with your life. Nobody's pu- nobody's putting a gun to your head telling you, hey, what? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, it's, it's, it's w- cool. <laughs> you better watch this video and enjoy it. Okay, yeah, that's man. cool. <laughs> Threaten me hey, with something else. I do like that they brought back the hairstyle, man. I just growing up being a kid in the '90s, man, just seeing the hairstyle a lot, man. It just kind of just made me, you know, you know. I used to see my <laughs> older cousins <laughs> and they 
I, I yeah, that's it. that's what he noticed. And that's the black to. culture, isn't it? Isn't it black culture? You know what I mean? I mean, you got the, the, the salute to it, man. Yeah, yeah it just, that, it was, that was the last thing I saw. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. I saw. I saw it, Demond. I saw it. I, I mean, it, 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 yeah. It I seen it. the house. The house looked dope. Oh my! God. I don't yeah. know if y'all seen the house, but the, the way house. they. Not gonna lie to you, that's a house I would definitely love to deliver if I worked at Amazon. I'm like, hey, oh, hey, here's your, here's your, here's your package. Oh, uh, uh, by the way, I have a beard. Um, <laughs> you know, I said y'all like people with beards, right? So. Yeah. Uh, you know what I'm saying? It's, it needs a little bit of moisture. You know? so, uh, <laughs> oh, Ross, that's how we going out. That's, hey, that's, yeah. gotcha. it is what it is, bro. TMI. Um, so no, yeah, that's a you know city girl type thing. But now uh, speaking of uh, so I seen the city girls on uh doing an interview today talking about how they don't mess with broke dudes. <laughs> oh, <laughs> they're talking about um, <clears throat> they were just Get going. The <laughs> you heard the side, the discipline. Yeah, I seen. It. They they was going in on broke niggas, talking about broke niggas. Um, they steal from you, and then they be aggressive, and you know they just if you gonna niggas, you fucking. Hey, you can't talk to me unless you ready to I don't steal from nobody. A check on me. I thought rich what? niggas can be like. I thought rich rich niggas are the worst ones that do that hey, shit, man. I, I'm so confused on. Nah, they was going in like I was just like broke niggas. <clears throat> Just Steal listen to, from you. Just listen to aggressive. the dialogue. Just listening to the dialogue, bro. I was like, man, like so many people are like, so like, you know, wow. It's 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 concerning. <laughs> like, mm -hmm. damn, you can't put everybody in the bubble. It's like niggas, you mess with stole from you. you mm -hmm. Um, you can't just call everybody broken and just you know shit on niggas. But oh, you right. gotta spend a bag on me to for me to show Basically, my worth to you. Pretty much. <laughs> That's what I do. I laugh. I hit him with the <laughs> you're funny <laughs> jokes on I you. Laugh in the face of danger. Like, <laughs> like the fuck, bro. I'm not about to spend my hard earned money to show you I'm not broke to buy you something. What the what the fuck am I gonna get? What what value do you bring in my life? You feel me? Like what are you what are you doing? I think I don't know. I don't know. It's this may I don't know. It's just my take. I think. I think chicks think pussy is everything nowadays when it's not. It's not. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> Newsflash, guys. Mm -hmm. that's, not even not. Like, that's, not, that's not even like top five anymore. North. It's you know, North. at least at least for adults. Maybe like we was kids, we were like, man, she got it. Yeah, pussy, yeah, yeah. Like, at, at this point, it's like, nah, man. I'm, pussy, pussy, like, I don't, I don't know where it ranked, but it ain't even top five on my list. Like, oh, you know. No. Like, you got you to gotta have a whole lot more for me to be like, all right, I'll spend some cash on you. Facts, mm -hmm. facts, facts, you facts. Know. And I think some people tend to forget. Well, I'll take that back. There's simps out there that <laughs> that go go above and beyond for some pussy. And yeah. that's what kinds of some it muddies the water because now people will think or certain women will think, oh well, you know what I'm saying? This is how I'm supposed to be treated. You know, not to say that a woman doesn't deserve nice things if they're in a relationship, but just because you're a woman and you have, you know, a vagina, now I have to spoil you off yeah. just yeah, off, off of that alone. No. Nah, bro. Y'all like, ain't having it, huh? No, mm -hmm. for, like, no, bro. <laughs> like, I'd rather you have, you got to bring something to the table. That's how I feel. If you're not bringing something to the table, and we're not just talking about just sexually or physically, like, you got to bring something to the table. How do you impact my life? You got to, you got to bring, I have my arm. Oh, fuck my arm. You got to bring the same shit you're looking for me to bring to the table. Mm -hmm. okay? Facts. Mm. Facts, man. I don't know one word, man. Let me start on that shit. Cause boys, be... come on, man, get in your bag, man. <laughs> boys. Nah, man, nah, 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 nah. Like, nah. It can't cause I got a hot date. She might, you know, I want to see this. It might go, it might go sideways. Well, so that's how you feel. <laughs> well, you know, the pod, the pod come out after the date, so you know what I'm saying. You pretty much safe. Yeah, they trying to put me up now. Nah. <laughs> right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dates. It's hey, okay, you scared. Want, hey, yeah, if I tell you, want to get that second date? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you trying to get future dates. It's hard to be scared. We'll talk for you. I told no. you I'm trying to wind and dine, shorty. Golly, this is going to contradict everything I'm saying. Oh, okay. 
well, it'd be different. It's it's different when you trying to, you know, court somebody or, you know what I'm saying, show them a good time compared to buying them thousands of dollars of Birkenbag. unnecessary brand name shit just because you're trying to prove a point Man, that you got, got it. <laughs> Yeah, like that's 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 the difference when it's like, oh, I'm trying to prove that I have it compared to courting someone. Like it's different. It's a major difference. A lot of yeah. people don't have it, and you can tell they don't have it, but they want to flex and put on for people that they don't even know in real life. You know, mm-hmm. see it all the time. <laughs> it's just putting it on for some chicks. Some I uh, it's a meme, bro. Someone said it was had the crying face on it, and he's he has a shirt like Dior on it. Like, please fuck me in my eight hundred dollars shirt, please. And <laughs> got the crying face. You know what, dog? I want to speak on that, dog, because cause you 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 would go out your way to spend all this money to look good, just mm-hmm. to be turned down so many times, and you be feeling like shit the that that same night, and you just like. You know what? Fuck this shit, dog. This ain't for me, man. I'm finna find me a woman and settle the fuck down. You been fuck there, Demond? That, that, <laughs> <now? laughs> that nigga, Demond, was out there. Christian Dior, Dior. <laughs> that nigga I, was out there. I, I, would, I would honestly say this. I I couldn't been there because I found the one before I even tried to attempt that lifestyle. Okay. Mm-hmm. Oh, just to be fair. I'm talking about, boy. Just talk to your shit. No, no, no. I, I, I'm, I'm, being, I'm being honest because, I mean, D just came out of fucking... Love you, babe. She just came hey, out of fucking nowhere. This nigga about to get an extra serving. And, and just killed extra all taco. my dreams of being a player. You feel me? Yeah. But anyway... um, Same here. But, uh, no, nah, I mean, I'm just saying, man. I, I could just... I could just see, and especially with the song got now, you know what I'm saying? How these women these days, man, they are on, on a whole nother level, man. I can only imagine the single life is like rough for guys out here today. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I'm not dealing with that. Babe, you got my taco? <laughs> hey, man. The only thing that sucks about it, bro, that mm-hmm. people don't think about it is you got to get old one day. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I, don't think, I don't think people. I don't even think people think about longevity. Nope. You know what I'm saying? Um, no, everybody live in the moment, though. Yeah. Which is, I mean, moment. you gotta, you gotta have two eyesight. You gotta have right now. You gotta have later. You know what I'm saying? Because if we really live in YOLO, we gonna spend all the money we got right now in the bank. Oh no. You feel me? That's no. why you. That's why we. <laughs> that's why you gotta have like two eyesight's about life. You know what I'm saying? Be mindful of right now, but also mm. kind of. Prepare just in case, to, you know. So, I just That's wish true. a lot of people, you know, was more thoughtful. I mean, you got people that get all tatted in the face and shit. And I'm just like, man, at 60 years old, how would that look? As a 60 year old man, <laughs> you got all these. Hey, you, hey, you seen that kid from uh from the DL Hughley show looking like that? For real? Yeah, man. The, the little, little boy. The little boy. Yes, tatted up all on the face, man. Living that whole West Coast gangster lifestyle, man. I saw that. Pull oh. it, pull it up, man. You would see. You'd be like, "What?" DL ain't <laughs> raising right, man. Yeah, he, no. <laughs> I mean, he, he, he was, right. He was oh, bad in the Lord. show, though. You know what I'm saying? So. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it, it was, was destined. Be- it was <laughs> destined for him to go that <laughs> it way. It was. I, I don't know, man. That's a rough lifestyle, man. I don't know. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I just, you just got to be mindful, bro. That's all. I just wish people, you know, because it's like one of them things that. Don't don't wait till it happened and then you just like oh shit what did I do you know what I'm saying I never <laughs> why I never, have man. I spent all this money on this chick that still doesn't want to fuck with me yeah. why <laughs> I just just gotta be mindful bro that's all because uh, I don't because it, it it causes a different type of depression when you look back in life on what you could have been doing and people mm-hmm. don't understand that shit man when you start hitting them. Them fifties and sixties, you start like, damn, bro, I could have been doing this. I could have been here. I could have been, you know what I'm saying? And then that's when you start regretting. That's when a different level of depression start to hit you. And um mm-hmm. I just wish people had some type of mindset of like, you know what? In case I get older, let me let me reserve how I move. Let me reserve how I do things. Let In me case not get, I get older. Let me not give myself to everybody. You know what I'm saying? And <laughs> especially and then me and the homies one day talked about this with chicks. Yo, yo, ch- I, okay. Tell me, tell me if I'm wrong. <clears throat> so, we always say, dudes, especially like good dudes, we have a meter for certain women. Like 
that we look for to settle down with. So when females start doing certain things, your your chances of getting with a, a real, real solid good dude starts to diminish the more you experience certain things and things happen to you in life. So let's say you out there and you get uh, a kid or two. A lot of like good, good dudes kind of want to have a family just with, you know, they chick and not, you know, kind of the traditional way. So like you kind of miss out on those dudes. Uh, the people you sleep with. Uh, if a dude found out one of the homies then been with you, okay, kind of diminish a little bit more in his book. Because some dudes be like, you know what? Nah, I can't, I can't, I can't settle down with somebody like this. I may, mm-hmm. I might slide in too. I don't know how the mood is, but I can't settle down with this. So it's like the more they go in life doing certain things, and I don't want to say mess up record, but like a bit of, you know, term, kind of like you, you doing more, and it's like diminishing the the level of guy that you in the more in life that you, you know, kind of have experiences that's not so great. So now you three, four kids in, you looking for a baby, you know, you looking for a dude now to deal with you when you got a couple mm-hmm. baby daddies and it's like now your chances of being with that, that nigga that you always wanted kind of be like low as hell. Which mm-hmm. I like that. that makes sense. It's kind of true. Yeah. That makes sense. For me, I mean, me, me being a a good dude. Well, I don't know what I am. <laughs> I'm, I'm a good I'm a good dude to the right chick. I I I'll say that. Okay. I ain't good to all of them. All of them don't deserve. All of them don't deserve what I could give to the the right chick. Mm-hmm. But uh, X. no, that's that's I I I, I kind of agree with you. You know, it just it it kind of it like I said, that value just kind of de- depreciates almost. You know? Yeah. Like a car, you know, you get drove, <laughs> quote unquote. You get drove all the damn time, you know. Shit, like, no, I, don't, I don't want that. Or you got, like I said, you got three, four kids. Like, no, I don't really. Not to say, not to say I hate cheering, but I, I technically don't want. Right, right, three right. Kids plus my one, which is four. I don't. I didn't want four mm-hmm. kids. Or right. Not, not the, and this ain't. This I get ain't what you're saying. <laughs> Yeah, put that out there now. This ain't kid bashing. This ain't this ain't chick with two. This ain't we ain't bashing nobody. This is just preference. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It kind of it kind of go back to what the city girls were saying about who they want. It's it's that's that's just their preference. Like, mm-hmm. I don't, we're not saying they was bashing us broke people. Yeah, we broke. We ain't rich. All right. That's how I knew. They're not bashing us, but that's, that's just their preference. But my preference, I think, I think all of us. Our preference isn't, you know, three, four kids in the hole. You know, you've been, you've been out here. You, you know, mess around <laughs> with the homie, this, that, and the other. You know, we, that ain't that ain't really what we. I can't I can't be a good dude to you. Like you may be good in heart. You may be you may be cold. Nah, right. I don't know. It's, I don't know. Damn, that sounds shallow. Warren, why you bring this up? I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm glad you said the depreciating of the value. I didn't want to say it, but that's exactly kind of where. It came from. I mean, it's it's really just to put it out there to like some of the females that you know think right now they got all the time in the world to get with everybody they can and you know rack up on kids. It's like, well, you know, when you about thirty five and you start to looking at life in a different view, <laughs> now the men that you was kind of passing over now they in position to mm-hmm. to be with somebody and they they gonna want somebody else in position equally yoked. They not gonna want nobody coming with a too much baggage you know we all got baggage but uh, it starts to get a lot when you child number one dad in jail child number two dad don't care for him <laughs> and it's just like damn now i gotta be this and plus i want my own child and it's mm-hmm. like the, the the mindset of always having to deal with this and this and that a lot of dudes don't want to deal with that so, hey, cause a, lot, right. a lot of niggas ain't a lot of me and it's and it's cool if you're not because a lot of niggas ain't built like that you know what i'm nah, saying not. like a lot of niggas ain't built to come in a picture Take care of you and and your kids, and I, some niggas ain't just for that. I'm. I mean, I one ain't. I ain't gonna say I'm one of them, but what <laughs> I, is that my is that my preference? <laughs> Not really. But, I don't think it's the, but it ain't. It ain't even the kid though, bro. I, like I, I'm with you because it really, it's just like the mindset of it not really being yours. Plus, it's always another person that's gonna be tied to that child. So it's yeah. like you always gonna have to have somebody else involved. In the child's life, if they in the child, but, 
it's it's easier. Honestly, the honest truth is, it's easier. If, let's just say the woman has three kids, but it's all with that one guy. You can deal with that. It's the yeah, that's truth for you. Is, it's the honest truth is, if you have four kids and you got three different baby daddies. I mean, that is hard to deal with. You know what I mean? Like, cause you don't know these these men that you dealt with in the past. You don't know what kind of mental they have to deal with you, mm -hmm. knowing that hey, you're gonna be the next man around their child, whoever. Right. You know what I'm saying? You gotta factor in a lot of stuff because people are freaking weird these days. They just can't deal with a lot of different scenarios that they put themselves in. So, um, you know, I mean, I don't know. I mean, I don't know. Like you know I, say, I mean, I you, really you gotta depend. Huh? Yeah, it really all just depend on like mm -hmm. what your because I met I met with no, that yeah, had. Sure. Two plus kids, and I'm like, man, she kind of, kind of cool, like you know, like I, 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 I want to be around her more. I like, I like spending right. time with it. And then you start like, damn, like I, I like shorty, like not even, not even thinking about how many kids she got. She's like, damn, she's just cool to be around. I'm like, yeah, I don't know. But then I, I can say that's, I don't know. I don't know, man. <laughs> <laughs> but see, that's what I'm saying, bro. We not we not bashing women that got children. I hope nobody felt like that at all. We just man, like, don't don't feel like that, ladies. This is we just speaking from because it, it's a like perspective. Versa. I mean, a lady don't want to deal with a man with multiple exactly all over the place. Well, it and depends because the it, niggas don't be it, having the kids. So, well, no, I mean, you know, you on a date with a man, you say I can't pay for it because I got too many child support to deal with. I'm sorry, you don't have to take care of the ticket. Are you a broke I mean, I mean, you know what I'm saying? That's hard to deal with. You know what I'm saying? But Facts. like, but I mean, Yo. I mean, you're but, right. That's that's for dudes too. Like, you it's, can't it's, it's, here making all these dumb ass choices, and then later on, you want to settle down with a woman. <laughs> you messed up your reputation. I've, I've I'm, had I've had women be like, you know what? I just I don't I just I can't deal with a man with a child. Cause like, right, well, fuck you, bitch. You ugly anyway. But I like, I get it though. I get it. That, that just may not be a cup of tea. That may not be respect. a respect. Exactly. I, I mm -hmm. respect you just lost <laughs> one. What Tony Baker be saying? <laughs> this thing is oh, oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> bitch, you ugly so anyway. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it'd be so, like that. Yeah, nah, I get it. So I, I, I hope the women can get where we come. Where we coming from? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, they probably won't. They probably gonna hear whatever they want to hear, like women do. Man, everybody, everybody got they. They mindset of who they want to settle down with when they get older. Like you, you got an idea. And at the same time, the flip can get script on you. I mean, the script can get flipped on you. And <laughs> <laughs> the script can get flipped on you, nigga. Somebody else will come out of nowhere and sweep you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know? So, I, like I said, I don't know, man. You just, I don't know. I don't know. Why my knees so dope? I don't know, man. Oh, that, was, that was good, though. I mean, you know. Again, hopefully, ladies, you know, we, we love you. You know what I'm saying? We never, you, you, have, you have your three kids. You take care of them. You feel me? Yeah, man, you, you be empowered. You listen to WAP, WAP and you, you be like, man, you know what? That's me. Yeah. And you go out and you do it. Go crazy. <laughs> Again, you know what I'm saying? That's your anthem. Call your side nigga up. Let them know you're going to come talk to the jaws. I don't know. Nope. That, I don't know. I don't know if that song's about a side nigga though, Demond. Did you listen to it? It's just about any nigga. I he mean, just, uh, he's I, putting he putting them all in the bubble, bro. He's saying they. Oh, hey, nah, you can't do that. I, I mean, I don't, I don't know. He assuming they got side dudes. You mm. think you think women just, you think women just be out here cheating like that? Man, they probably. Do. <laughs> man, they working us, man. He hey, said hey, they probably hey, do. hey, look, quick, quick question. You know, I be coming with the question. Come on. Um, Come how, many, how, many, how many times I got cheated on? How many times do y'all recall? I got cheated on one time. Zero. You got cheated on ninety times. Shut up. Let me tell you. Nah, it's definitely mm. one time, bro. To be I honest, ain't had that many, I mean, I ain't had that many relationships to get cheated on ninety times. Man. Yeah, me neither. But zero. God, God oh, on the street. This, this, this didn't. I, this didn't turn out the way I wanted it to be. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> no, nah, go, go ahead, man. I ain't want you to. Get discouraged. All right, how many? All right, how many times do y'all do y'all think y'all got cheated on? It'll be the same answer. None. Twice. I ain't been no relationship, so I have none. I'm glad you answered for me. <laughs> <laughs> Let's start with you. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let's start with you and go down the chart. Did I? No, nah, it always start with me, and then it get down to y'all and be like, hey, man, I don't know, and then we move on to something else. 
<laughs> I'm trying to no, save see, you. Uh, let me see. Uh, do I think? See, I wasn't in relationships like that, bro. I wasn't a relationship person. So I was just like, what's the point of being in a relationship? I ain't really want to be tied down to nobody. Mm. Oh, okay, so, see, I, I was different. Like, I, I wanted to be. Well, back, not that I wanted to be back then, but I, I always was just ended up in a relationship with somebody. Like, I've only, I've only, like, believe it or not, I've only been in like three serious relationships. Mm-hmm. You know, and like they've all been like long, like they've all, you know, long term. You know, three, two. two years, three years, five years, and shit. I've been in two, yeah. and, and Nisha, my wife, now is my second one. So um, yeah, and I, I think I think maybe two two of them chicks probably. Yeah, well, one. All right, one I know for sure. Now that you're thinking about it, <laughs> one I know one for sure. I, I caught that motherfucker. Really? Twice. Yeah. Like in Damn. the act or like text messages. I mean, if I want to story, I can tell you. Look, I didn't tell y'all many times. I got stories. Hey, come on. Just, it was in the act. Give me the time slot to get them out. It was in the act or like text messages. All right, listen. Come so on, who throwing pots and stuff? No, that's my wife right, clean. Well, listen. How about you tell the, How about you put your hoof down and tell the stop? Cause you busy. <laughs> can say. How about you put your hoof down? <laughs> <laughs> hey, huh? We trying to record a podcast. You're trying to get people no. divorced. Hey, hey, Graylin, Graylin, it doesn't work like that, Dom. So, <laughs> no, I know that's why I was just saying because I, I have no idea. Hey, no, um, the day I see Demond, <laughs> hey D, turn it down in there. Come on, fucking podcast. You know that, you know that nigga that went rogue. Yeah, he <laughs> didn't went rogue. Demond is like Demond no more. <laughs> no more. <laughs> on, come come outside and play. Nah, man, I gotta, I gotta stay inside. Yeah. Nah, nah, you gonna jump on two K tonight? Nah, it's two, it's two K. No, no, no. If I'm going for a whole week, it's a problem. Call somebody. <laughs> I if I said a whole week. <laughs> if I go a whole week, nah, I, I a can't whole tonight, week fellas. without two K, I done did something wrong. I can't I jump on tonight, fellas. D, D, D took the PlayStation. She put it in the attic. <laughs> I can't play right now. I bet you know. Nah. Did no, she knew she, she 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 wouldn't do that. She know that would crush my soul. That's <laughs> the point. Chicks want to crush you. The point, dude. That's that's an ass whooping. Hey, you nah, <laughs> nah. She wouldn't do that, dog. Hey, the let's not talk hey, about this, man. Let's move on to the next conversation. Yeah, we see you, you getting me. You getting hurt? She'll do that shit. I'm getting I'm getting bad visions. Yeah, I know. But then, but see, them the visions you need so you can know, so you won't be surprised. Mm-hmm. This nigga, come on, baby. Where's my PlayStation? It's oh. in the tub. Take it a bath. No. <laughs> right, that nigga say it's in the tub. Take it a bath. <laughs> no, baby. In all your ears. No. He will get the whole try to try to wrap me in the child. Oh no, come on. Come on, please, baby. No. Oh my I don't want to hear this conversation no more. Demar gonna lose this. Nah, nah, nah. How about how about if she did that prank on you and she deleted your uh players off of 2K? Ooh, oh, but then hey. but see that prank went wrong, bro. Let me tell you something. Uh-oh. When oh, I saw oh. that, I had to show D exactly what not to do. What you mean it went wrong? That he prank was like, she, she, because she didn't know, she didn't realize that he can't get it back. And see, Wait, so maybe it didn't see, go that's, wrong. That's, a, that's another thing. No, <clears throat> that's another but no, thing. That's what I'm saying. She pranked because she was like, "Oh, he can just get it back." She was like, "Oh, I just thought you could re-download it." He was that's like, another thing. Mm-hmm. Women. Sit your ass down. Stop fucking with our <laughs> shit. You see us going in there, putting your makeup backwards and taking all the backs of your earrings and shit. Like, oh, she can just get some more. Like, no, hmm. it's, it's more. It's, it's more complicated than that. That's true. Stand I stand with us. this. I stand with this conversation. <laughs> Play too damn much all the time. <laughs> that's when Demond will put his hoof down. Damn it, baby. <laughs> yeah, no, I, ain't, I, no I, I, ain't no baby. He probably crazy. Ain't no baby. I will probably snap. Gonna be on tonight's news. <laughs> reporting, Houston, reporting live. Demond Simeon, who's your ugly ass mugshot? It started with a 2K player <laughs> and migrated <laughs> and migrated into the parking lot, a parking lot brawl. <laughs> Ride over there and look at it too. Now this is I ain't ride over there. This is the vehicle that he seemed to have ran her over with. Uh, it a still white, has a white van. <laughs> 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 
he laughed. He got the devious laugh. It's a white yeah. man. Yeah, crazy Keisha. man. Yeah, crazy man. <laughs> he got Keisha out of stories. But nah, Grayley, you was about to uh, tell us your story. Oh well, shit. Um, man, I want to. Nah, fuck it. I'm out here. I'm, I'm hard. Go ahead, man. You out here, cuz? Come on, let's get us to yeah, get us be. to the next level. Yeah, you know. But see, that's 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 what I don't like. Though it's always me. That's not true. I was nah, doing it the last. I've been doing that the last couple podcasts. Right there, giggling and leaning yeah, back. He, he ain't gonna help. <laughs> you, you don't never tell your stories because Nisha gonna get up for your ass. Thank you. It's all, Thank you for understanding. Malisha ain't ever healed, so it's always me. <laughs> I don't like it. I don't like it. She holding <laughs> it in. Malisha don't ever heal. Look, how about it's true? How about how she dipped out on us though? But well, we knew that was coming. What you mean? Yeah. <laughs> Tell right, long story short, long story short. Sixty day notice coming. Long story short, I was out. I was out with the homies. We was gonna go to the movies and see this new movie came out. I forget what the movie was. It was three of us, right? And uh, my girl at the time, uh, she was like, she was babysitting her goddaughter. And right around the time we was gonna go to the movies, she was like, "Hey, I'm gonna go take take little mom back to the uh, to a people house. You know, I'm gonna call you and get it done." I was like, "All right." Now, granted, uh, little mama people house, she they lived like a little way from us, like maybe like 40 minutes away because we right. stayed like right, right by each other. Good so excuse. I was like, all right, I was like, all right, it's gonna take her a minute, so you know, I'm, I'm gonna be waiting on a phone call. So, me and the homies was gonna grab something to eat before we went to the movies. So we round up, round around and shit in the parking lot trying to find somewhere to get some grub. Oh, I know this. Next story, thing I oh, know, man. my homie here, he was like, hey, ain't that uh. For the second story, I'm gonna call her. Uh, I'm gonna call her Nikki. For the second story, she was like, "Hey, he was like, hey, ain't that uh, ain't that a uh, Nikki call?" And I was like, "I was like, yeah, it is a call. Hey, let's go fuck with it." Not, none. Of, it didn't dawn on me that she just hit me five minutes earlier. Was like, "I'm gonna go take little mama back to the people house," and it's forty minutes away. <laughs> none of that dawned on me. I was like, "Hey, let's go fuck with it real quick," you know, boom, boom, boom. So we pull up on her, and my partner was like, "Hey, who the uh?" Who that she got in, in the car with her? And I was like, no. I don't know. It's probably uh, it's probably her brother. Like you know, her and her brother be they be going out shopping and doing whatever together. Like they real close. Again, never dawned on me that she just called me five minutes early. Was like, I'm gonna take little mom back to us out of town, which forty minutes away. Right. I'm still like, let's go fuck with her. So they pulled into a little restaurant or whatever, and when she pulled in, my partner pulled up like behind her. And then I seen him. Damn, bro. Is I it hurt? Like, is, is it too soon? No, nah, that was years ago. You, okay. you kind of got into a moment, though. You was like, Nah, because I'm just like reflecting. <laughs> he, he, yeah, he's just I'm, doing his face thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm and reflecting, you know? So I, I see him you. and I was like, Damn, that's dude she told me not to worry about. So she get out. Damn. She get out. She not knowing it was me behind the street. She got out. And I was like, I broke down the wall. I was like, Hey, what's up? And she was like, Oh. Babe, you you scared me. What are you what are you doing here? And I was like, you know what the what are you doing here? Like I thought you was, you know, boom boom boom. I was like, who who you got with you? Who is that? Like I don't know. We just we just getting some lunch. We just we just getting some lunch. It's nothing. So the whole shebang popped off. I was gonna get out and jump on, buddy. But my homies were like, nah, don't do it. It Ain't worth it. It ain't his fault, man. So yeah, that was it. We left. We still went to the movies, and I I was crying in the movies. End, end of story. <laughs> you was crying in the movies. Damn, that hurt, bro. You was crying yeah. in the movies. Yeah, man, it was sad. Not Damn, the movies, bro. but my situation. No, I, I got it. Damn, like how long was the movie? That must have been a hard yeah. ninety minutes, dog. Hard, that was a he hard said a, 90 a hard ninety minutes. No. That was a hard ninety minutes. Dude. Hope it wasn't an action movie. I forget what movie it was. I didn't give a damn shit. Yeah, your your tears was in the way. Right. And I think Damn. it was gonna be I, I really wanted to see, but I I couldn't get into it. Oh, she said, "Oh, man. oh, what are you doing here?" Damn, that's what. So, so do y'all fight the other person? No. Okay, mm-hmm. cool. We all we all the same mind. I mean, Grayley mm-hmm. wanted to. But I mean, of course, instinctively, I, I but just, I was just incensed with anger. You know, I mean, I, like, I gotta if, fight somebody. If he don't talk shit, it's like, yeah. he didn't even get out the car. Because in my head, I'm like, all right, either I'm beating your ass. I'm beating his ass. He not jumping out. <laughs> you in my vicinity, so I might have to jump on you, shorty. <laughs> Honestly, though, I feel like fighting would look like a jackass. You got to make her feel bad. 
you gotta see it and you gotta just walk out the room slowly or something. You know, he gotta kill oh, him, mindset, bro. Whatever. I mean, you, you you gotta kill him hard, man. You just gotta make him feel miserable. You gotta strap him you down. Gotta, you shoot him up. Shoot him up with come adrenaline. Come on, come on. Let me let me let me let me help you out. Let me help you out. Let me help you out. Cause like you said, you never been cheated on. That's not how it works. I've been cheated on one time. <laughs> That you did. Mm-hmm. No she told me. She, t- she she told me to. She she. That nigga she had some powers. Like, that I'm nigga. Gonna, the I'm gonna show her. No 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 no. I'm gonna be honest with you. She told me she was oh. sitting in the car. We we was arguing and shit. She was just like. It came out during the argument. Mm-hmm. And she. she at, at, oh, no, that's fucked up. No, oh, at, at the no, she hated. <laughs> that's why hated, you can't dance. No, listen. Oh. She hated my best friend at at the time. My best friend is my wife. Uh, was my wife now. Mm-hmm. So. Hmm. Um, Funny how things come full circle. She, she was like, yeah. "I know, I know that's gonna be. You gonna be with her eventually." She she was always telling me that. She was honest about it because I was always on the phone with D. We would talk all the time, and uh, she was like, "That's oh. why I cheated on your ass because he got more experience." <laughs> and I'm like, what you mean? Wait, nah, bro. Wait, 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 No, 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 no. Listen, no. Like in a relationship or like in the bedroom? Yeah, like fuck. Nah, bro. She, she gotta run it. She, she gotta you run it. Like in your face? I'm, nah, was, she gotta I, run it. I, I was, pause. Uh, pause. I was nope. Hey, pause. I was, pause. Uh, pause. You want me to keep nope. that on the pod? <laughs> she I mean, gotta I run it. Care. I mean, I mean, this is 2010. She gotta run it. She gotta run it. What you talking about? It's just 10 years. 10 years ago, man. She gotta run it. How much more experience did you get after that? That was recent. She gotta run it. She gotta run it. She told you that? She gotta run it. She was like, yeah, he's 28 years old, and I'm like, you, you know. You was young, I'm too. I'm like, yeah. At the time. I mean, because she was so jealous of D, y'all. She knew what's up. Damn that. She got to run it. Women, nah. women, women be knowing what to say to hurt you, though, bro. She, That's what I'm I, saying. I, I, I feel like, like, I feel like, 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 like yo, ain't no, ain't no, like, oh, I'm going to get her back. No, bro. Whatever. She got to run it. know how to get you. You ain't going to do nothing that's going to, like, compare to what she said to you. She has to run them. I ain't going to lie, bro. She would have been missing. hands. She would have been missing. Run Listen. them hands like my boy Caleb City. You, you put them up. She, that's what you did. You was like, I'm gonna show her. Watch. No. I, Watch later that, on but, in life. Uh, really, it was her that allowed me to just like when she say she stay hurtful, a lot of hurtful things, and I used to be like, damn, this bitch crazy. But <laughs> damn, no. <laughs> hey, granny, 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 granny. This, 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 this the same one that tried to cut me. <laughs> Oh, you got stories. <laughs> he got some stories for real. Yeah, though. yeah, no, no, no. No, he really I mean, do got some stories. He told Grayling, you Grayling, he got more experience. Grayling remember the apartment yeah. that I got in in, in Pearland, dog. It was for me and her, bro. We, yeah. it was, uh, that was one of the most toxic relationships I ever been in. Dog. We used to fight. Well, yeah, let, let me rephrase that. I used, I used to wait. I, <laughs> I used to react surprisingly because she would slap the shit out of me and it just catch me off guard. And I'm like, oh, oh shit, what the, you, what what the you, you know, you know what I'm saying? I used I mean, to, the boss say, oh, shit, I thought it was a fly. <laughs> Hit me. Sorry. No, Sorry, but bro. then I, I catch myself every time. But no, seriously, it's very toxic, man. <laughs> ten, and, uh, ten blows in. This nigga, the, the mom I'm, was running them hands. But she, she. I got the power. I, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm be honest with you. I, this is what I give her credit for. Don't be too honest. She changed me because I was one of those guys that would call like 20 times when she asked. She was like, stop being a bitch ass nigga, man. Like, I'm, you know, if I'm not going to answer your call, I'm not going to answer. That's the, what, who hey, is, now you know what? Hey, you we, know we, what need to, we need to talk after the pod, you know bro. You know what, Demond? You know what, boy? I'm being I honest. I'm not got nothing. Because just by you saying that, some shit had talked back in my head, bro. I've been there. I've yeah, been I'm, there. I'm, and I didn't I'm just them being. I'm just saying, she, this is a healing pod. She, she, this she, is she, healing, honestly, she honestly changed me for the better, dog. Because, I mean, that was like my, I mean, I was fresh out of high school trying to get in a serious relationship. And, like, she was like, stop being a bitch ass nigga. I ain't answering your calls. I'm busy. And I'm like, you know? He, hey, he don't, he Where's she the from? Truth. The north he side? Telling, no, he's telling the truth, dog. Nah, she's I've from the southeast there, side, bro. bro. I've been there, dog. With it, with it, when my chick told me that, that's why I don't. That's why I don't give a fuck now. Mm-hmm. Like you acting like a bitch. I'm like, oh. I, I, I'm right. telling you. I, if, so. I mean, if it wasn't for me, <laughs> then the nephew, monster was born. Right. And that's what? that's the reason why I don't I don't care about nothing now. The monster <laughs> was born. I don't want to show my my feelings and then be like a bitch. So I'm just be you like, gotta, fuck it. You gotta add the exactly. cinematic. Bro, the I monster promise was you, born. I'd day. probably be the same the same way if I was living a single life. But I mean, obviously, I got in a relationship with my best friends, but. 
you would see it because the way how she say. she changed me though she was just like and I'm, I'm like okay so I just need to be ruthless with the females okay cool the mom and ruthless that is that's, that's why I'm still the same way I am now that's why I, but but it's true how a lot of dudes like kind of get get their feelings crushed the first time Facts. it kind of shapes it shapes their mentality into something Facts. you know based off of that you know and a lot of times but, but it's actually a good thing because you know you shouldn't be you know you shouldn't be a clingy guy like that i mean i mean obviously not I, that's changed everything since i'm married now but i'm saying if if i was to i mean i wouldn't say that life. because if you would have met somebody else or if dean was that in a relationship with the time she would have never came at you like that and then you probably would have had that same almost similar mindset but it depends on who you come in contact with. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, there's a way to say shit. Yeah, you don't. But when a nigga hit you with the something like a bitch ass nigga, yo, that's some hateful shit. You don't tell like, nobody whoa. that. That's women, y'all know that. I mean, at the oh, same yeah. time, bro, she she was she was. I mean, when we met, I was had a raggedy ass white van with no AC. But you had <laughs> a van. She, you know, a she lot of niggas didn't have a car. Man, listen, that van went through it, y'all. If, <laughs> 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 but she was hey, she was with me, man. Our first date was taco. Oh, no, CC pizza, and then the next time we went to Taco Bell. You know Damn, she was is... down for me. She was cool. It just she talked. She, she just uh, I was being a little bit of a simple. I mean, I was 19, 20 years old, man. I mean, you know. she just had to respect yeah. you. You right? That's true. Yeah. Respect. She, yeah, pretty much. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Just call a spade. A but spade. the one thing she respected was my my relationship with my best friend. She was like. You gonna be with her one day. I mean, I I never understood it because we were together. I'm like, what? I'm just like, what the hell are you talking about? You know what I'm saying? And she was right. (laughs) Did she tell you? She told you so. Shout out to her, man. I hope you're doing well. Why you looking in the sky? You have much. Oh no, I was I was trying to catch you, nigga. No. (laughs) Oh man, that's because I had to kick her out, bro. (laughs) Just so he did have the final word. He 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 gave her the boot. Hey, you gotta get out. No, man, because I got tired of her asking me to bring in Little Caesars, and I'm like, why don't you cook for once? You know what I'm saying? So I got pissed off. Yeah, why don't you cook for once, you lazy cunt? She, she, she created this monster, so I might as well use it against her. This yes. nigga say, I want pizza. Embrace hate. the hate, demand. Embrace it. That nigga say, I want DiGiorno's. You keep on asking me to bring in Little Caesars. This nigga says, you lazy. She, cre- she created this monster. Listen, so I mean, I was me working. I paid food, woman. I, I mean, I was paying all the bills and everything, and she was Ooh. just, a, you know, she was oh, nah. just, oh. you Hit know. Hit the road, Jack. And don't you yeah. come back no more, yeah. no more, no more, no more. Every time I come home, home, every time I come home, she be laying in the bed like, hey, babe, you got the nah. thing? I'm like, yeah, I got it. This, I just turned into a venting session, man. This is a healing, healing. It is. Niggas are healed. And you see, you see how, you see how it's always. You see, it's always the two people that it's always two people that's not. <laughs> it's not the hoes, huh? It's always it's, it's always two people that's not getting their shit off, and that's yeah. what I don't like about this place. I'm, I'm you, want my, you want me? To, you want me to join in on the healing process? No, I no, I'm no, healed, bro. Don't do it. Don't you want me to join in? Uh, Go ahead, Ross. Join in, Ross. You want me to join in? Because I, I said something. Oh, mm-hmm. no. You want me to join in, man? No, man. No, I was, guess, hey, guess what? Hey. Guess what? Guess what? The time up. We better smoke an hour now. <laughs> <laughs> he say time up. Episode thirty two. We got you, Ross. Episode thirty two. <laughs> That's for you. That's how they do them all. They let it, they let us get our shit off. It's like mm-hmm, yeah. it was I mean, good. Mm-hmm, 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 it was good. I'm gonna be but honest with you. See what y'all went through is the reason why I want to be in a relationship. All that shit mm-hmm. that you have to worry about. I was like, nah, bro. I'm nah, that and I agree with you. People get in a relationship not to go no further, just to be in a relationship. I never understood that. Like, I'm that's that's the whole married thing. or I'm gonna be single. That's you know that's I mean? the whole thing, bro. Niggas in high school, like, bro, you should get a girlfriend, you should get a girl. And it's like, man, like I'm saying, well, no, that's different though. And high school is different though, man, because you you trying to you experiencing girls for the first time, but like if you're 29, talking about yeah, I'm just trying what? to find a relationship. You know what I mean? <laughs> he said you experiencing on, girls for the first time. <laughs> what did you say to I'm saying in high school, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Like, you said, you we said in high school, school it's all about time. it's all a, it's all about popularity, trying to get the hottest girl, or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Getting a relationship. Wait, I, wait, you know what I'm, I'm saying? saying that's high you, school. Said, you said that's what we experienced, girls, for the first time in high school. Yeah, I mean, I, what you? I mean, yeah, I wasn't fucking in middle school. Oh man, I mean, that's on y'all. 
No, I wasn't. I wasn't. <laughs> Listen, I was, I was, I was, was What you was doing, really? <laughs> 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 <What's> you, <laughs> this being girls, you fucking nerds. Damn, <laughs> in, in middle school? You toxic. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, was, I was proud to be in the band hall in hey, middle school. Hey, boy. Hey, hey, but I guess I can tell you one thing. Ain't no chick going to tell me. I ain't experienced. Damn. <laughs> Now you hitting below the belt. What is this? Hey, man. Hey, man. Hey, <laughs> hey, man. No, that's fair. That's, <laughs> no, that's, he cold. That's fair, he cold. That's fair that's, game, man. That's why nobody, that's hey, nobody want to heal to you. It, no, listen. That's fair board. game, bro. Listen. Hey, I'd rather be me than something in the comments. But you going to spin it back. You're not supposed to spin it back. You on her but side. No. All right, Jamal. Give me back, bro. Tell, I ain't gonna tell you nothing, bro. No, no, I got your back, Grayland. That's fair game. She said it. She said no, it proudly, nigga, too. Get him back. Now you got Warren? his back. No, hey, 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 Warren. <laughs> hey, you don't have no place to speak. You, you ain't cold. even share, my nigga. You cold, mm-hmm. bro. You ain't even hey, man, share. Look. Why would I share? You going to spin it back on me. <laughs> <laughs> you using it as weapons. <laughs> bro, as many times as it's a man. It's fair game. As many as I told y'all, y'all spin it back on me, man. Come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's true. <laughs> Oh, oh. Find a way out, like he always do. I don't have like relationship crazy ass stories. Yeah, I got I got crazy life out, stories. Well, oh, I want hear that. Just because nobody stabbed me and shit, I, I ain't good enough. <laughs> attempted to stab. Attempted. Attempted. You know, she. Brandon almost got stabbed too. Hey, listen, I, I, got stabbed. Mm-hmm. Stabbed me. I had caught up by the wrist, and she was still trying to do this. <laughs> Damn, not this. <laughs> Whoa, I was like, this hey, she, she was almost in there. Boy, I, I bet, caught a I boom. Bet, I bet no. your mom was like, oh, shit. I'm oh, like shit. This. Oh, shit. No, boy, I called her mama, dog, because I was like, she's walking around. Oh, and walking you called her mama? You called her mama, I, I, had, I had to kick her out. And I called the mom. I said, look, your daughter's around this apartment complex. Please come get her because I don't know what to do. She can't come. Why ain't just call the police? <laughs> I ain't want to wanna get jail. in trouble. Come on, man. No. She done went to jail, nigga. She tried to stab you, bro. Yeah, I didn't want her to go to jail. <clears throat> That's why. Or I you just... could have just, just kicked out and just left her alone. <laughs> You got a heart to come outside eventually, though. So. You know, you got to have a heart a little bit. I just cut through a little bit. I mean, you know what I'm saying? See, give us some type of slack. Wait, what I'm seeing here is you healing different from Grayland. Huh? <laughs> you healing different from you. <laughs> what? You got a dark healing going on. He got a more who me? Blue-esque. Yeah. Man, listen. That, that nigga said, "Why you I just kick her out and leave her alone?" <laughs> I've been I've been through what I've been through, and that's why I am how I am. All right. <laughs> the monster was born. Uh, the monster was is, born. Man. The monster was born Just that day. Born. For the longest, man. You can't. Mm-mm. Those words were heard and just echoed in his head. <laughs> you a bitch. Stop nigga. being a bitch. Oh, stop being a bitch. Stop being a bitch. And then he just woke up one day. I'm not a bitch. Hey, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> and the man was born. Why you don't, why you don't like caress me anymore? Why I gotta fucking caress you? Got my bed. <laughs> Oh wow, you an asshole now. Oh, okay. women that's what women like sometimes, but you gotta be sweet and an asshole at the same time. It's true. Gotta be a, gotta be a real jinky. Mm-hmm. Okay. And then they hit you, oh you're so mean. And then still be there. <laughs> so, Ross, so Ross, you sharing next podcast, right? No, we ain't. <laughs> yes, no, we not. I'll share next podcast, bro. Ross gonna have a whole podcast. Oh, the whole right. podcast. Dang. You know I'm saying, like, you got enough <laughs> for an hour. I do got a, plenty of uh, <laughs> delectable <laughs> stories. Yeah. I got uh, a lot of great, fun stories. To, uh, hey, they going to have to hear you, Ross, man. You the main yeah. face of this tell, whole tell thing, dog. Was, man. Tell the juicy was Not them, not them little bit of patty cake stories. Tell got, the juicy ones, mm-hmm. man. Nah, bro. Not the juicy ones. ones. <laughs> nah. <laughs> You know which one? Yeah, the ER at two in the morning ones. Oh, hey man, man. hey, hey Raw t- hey, hey. Raw tell the juicy ones. Y'all going straight to a million. <laughs> nah, <laughs> bro. <laughs> I'm t- trying, hey, to, trying to tell them to the uh, to the next level. Yeah, yeah. it's time. To it's time stories. to go there. All right, I got I got some stories. Man. He's, gonna, he's gonna start getting calls. You know what? We might want to put you on a reality TV because <laughs> hey, this this Ross character he be going through some shit. 
that always, only he could go. I always told Ross that. I was like, bro, you live a movie life, bro. Like, you, yeah, I never seen a nigga go through so much bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> he, yep. he go through every emotion. Right. Tough. I need my fifteen percent. Oh my god. Fifteen percent off the top. But now, right. um, this is this is an interesting podcast, man. We appreciate y'all boys for joining, man. We gonna have to do this again. Um, One person that wasn't healing, and then we just turned into a heal therapy session. <laughs> she ain't gonna never heal. Graylin knew, dog, because I I kept it real on that story, man. That when she she hey she stop being a bitch. If I don't answer your phone call, it is what it is. I want to name that the title of the podcast, but it probably won't get approved. And then she hang up in my face. That'd be the worst feeling. I'm just sitting there in the room like. Mm. Should I call again? Like, Damn, nah, I, should I, I, I call again? I've been there. You know, I was I living with there. my daddy. He ain't had there. a line, so I was just trying to play the game, try to keep my mind occupied. Uh, this, I'm this, this shit off for real tonight. I'm just saying. Damn, that's how I, was. I mean, I'm uh, every man. Every man would relate to this story, bro. I, you can't tell me you haven't been on. I mean, I don't know outside of one. You say you only been in one relationship. But it's the truth, man. I ain't been calling no. I ain't been calling no bitch. <laughs> the younger me would have been a little bit more ruthless. I'm like what? Got me fucked. Been there. Mm. I don't know, man. It's just, there. it's just. That's that. I tried to avoid all that, bro. I just seen relationships. I seen what the homies was going through, and I was just like, man, I'm, I'm cool. Like, I, I, I'll just be me. And then, especially when I graduated, it's just like, bro, for what? And you know what? The, the craziest thing is, I always was the one that told my mom. I wouldn't be married. <laughs> That's the funny thing about life. You know how you mm. always got them, them, I ain't gonna never. I always said that. I was like, bro, I ain't gonna never. I don't see how people be married. And I used to tell my mom and dad that because they just celebrated 40 years. So I was like, man, I don't know how y'all do it. Like, I always talk shit. Look at yeah, God, God, like I bet. <laughs> yeah, that's, yeah, that's exactly <laughs> what happened. That's the funny thing about life. I just, I was about to be chilling. Straight out of bet. high school, we was cutting up, we was getting into shit. And next thing you know, boom. Nigga, mm-hmm. you thought mm-hmm. you thought mm-hmm. you meet me this. at the altar in your <laughs> 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 we ain't get no young. Like walking down the aisle, trying to rock and back and forth to shit. You yeah, right. gotta come hug you. Had to, had to throw the black book away, man. Early. Oh, give so, me um, here. That's in. It's collecting dust. It's probably been oh, okay, uh, okay, disintegrated okay. by now. I don't know where it's at. Good. It's good you don't know where it's at. Very good. <laughs> wink, wink. I can see see Nisha just just over there on the on the phone <laughs> right off screen, just <laughs> <laughs> got a little AirPods in, knowing damn well. She, oh yeah, she listening. She, <laughs> that whole oh, she just trying to make sure I ain't gonna say nothing crazy. But I mean, mm-hmm. she knows what's up. But now, nah, um, yeah, man, appreciate y'all for joining podcast episode 31 appreciate the homie demand we got to get demand in here again man he was, yeah that was <clears throat> without the the extra stuff tough. at the beginning but yeah it was it was great <laughs> hey man they, the fans know it's pure man because i was super busy you know my wife was telling me get the food you know what i'm saying she got mighty quiet so i'm a little bit nervous i'm hoping i'm good oh lord jesus yeah oh lord jesus is fire <laughs> about to get in trouble again <laughs> Uh, <laughs> it was dinner night tonight. It was taco night, and you said you was gonna be available. Taco Thursday. Tacos away on that nigga. It was taco Thursday. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, man, we love you guys, man. Y'all stay safe in them COVID streets, man. Don't be going too crazy. Uh, keep on joining in. Make sure you listening on Apple, Spotify, uh, watching the video on YouTube. Keep on tuning in, bro. It's gonna get better and better, baby. For sure. We love y'all. Mm. Man. Peace. Mm-hmm. Thank you.